in the old days, and I spent a lot of time in the editing room, um, picture editing room, uh, it's actually where I learned more about making movies than I did on the set because I was around a lot of this through my father, uh, and I'll go into all of that history later if you're interested, but um, uh, I would see how movies are put together. And, and so when I would go to a movie, um, particularly even something I had worked on and all, and you would see that the, the, the picture editing, um, you wouldn't really even be aware of it. You know, you wouldn't say, oh, I'm in a two shot or I'm in a single or like that. It's just that seamlessly you would be where you want to be in the scene dramatically. And you realize that the scene may end up on a, on a huge close up of somebody and, you, and you're not even aware of how you got there. That to me is like good editing. And I hope to do the sound that goes along with that editing that doesn't take you out of the scene in any way, but just further involves you so that when you're finally in that close up, you're you're seeing and hearing the performance that uh, the the director wants. It's um, it's really interesting so. how everything seems to have because of I guess the the speed of evolution in terms of just audio going digital and then everything else that knocked on from that from then everything being filmed digitally. It's, yep. it's interesting that now all our we're kind of solving our problems that we're kind of causing and we're still we're still fumbling Absolutely. through fumbling through the forest a little bit but we're yep. we're making steps yep. steps out of the, 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 because the tech again I don't want to paint this picture that that you know that all this technology is like you know destroying the way we used to make <laughs> movies although I am a little bit of um, you know I'm I'm an old guy and I've been you know around <laughs> for a long time and I do miss I do miss the things that I could focus on in the early days because I wasn't worrying about the equipment. I wasn't worrying about whether stuff would be in sync. I wasn't worrying about whether, you know, somebody had all of a sudden, you know, released some specification sheet based on some other production they have done where they say, you know, well, we told you 48K, but we really want 48048. Uh, you know, can we go to that today? Uh, and then, you know, will you just make a note? And then, you know, all that kind of stuff. That we just never had to worry yeah, about those things. Yeah, the um, app.